Hello, YouTube. I'm Jake from Peyton B and their friend, and tonight we're going to be taking a look at a DS game that uh, I bought recently. So let's get it out of the unboxing box. Or the. Oh, no, I mean the unboxing basket. I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh. Um, okay, so, yes, here is what we're looking at today, um, let's, um, let's just get a good zoom in here. Now, I got this over at Geek Galaxy. Don't worry, guys, I'm not being sponsored by them, as some of you have been concerned. I'm not, um don't do sponsorship don't ask but yes um i paid 15 dollars for this yeah um i'm going to be honest y'all i have not price checked this game recently so i don't know maybe that is what it's worth but I'm going to hit a heavy doubt on that because, honestly, most DS games ain't worth shit. And, yeah, also, guys, I'm going to be comparing it to this. Now, you might be thinking, Jake, what shenanigans are you pulling out today? Hmm? Is this some trickery from the Peyton B and their partner? Um, <laughs> but, um, I will explain, okay? This is, this is the same game that I got from GameStop, like, I think four years ago by now. And you see, whenever I got it, it only worked once, and then after that, it did not work again. Yeah, now at GameStop, I paid, like, four ninety nine for it, so, I mean, obviously, I wasn't, like, in the hole or anything, but I was not happy because, as you guys know, I love Hello Kitty. And, yeah, to test this game, though, to make sure that it works, because I will be darned if it does not work, I will march in there and um, get a refund. But... Yeah, this is actually my new 3DS XL. Well, it's not new, because I've had it basically ever since the new 3DS XL released. Um, I don't even remember when that was. I'm gonna be honest, it's been so long ago. Reflective Surface. Let's get this game out of here. Um, yeah, I was playing Miitopia. Um, actually, I'm just gonna put that back in there because, you know what, I think first off, um, I better prove that my poor DS, 3DS, here is working. Um, don't question the wallpaper, um, yeah, but see y'all, see, I can go on here and I can literally play Metopia. I have, um... Well, I'm not going to show my activity log in this video, but, man, I've got, man, I've got the hours racked up on some of these games, man. All right, we'll put that back in there. But, uh, okay, well, I, oops, I, oh, well, I forgot if I can do this with gloves on. Okay, there we go, um. Okay, yeah, you can see, though, by my games here, I have quite the taste, man. Um, I'm gonna pick a DS game just to show that my 3DS does, in fact, play DS games, because some people out there are actually not the brightest, and for some reason think that 3DSs cannot play DS games. Yeah, I don't know why. Because, 
I mean, I know Nintendo has not always had the best track record of backwards compatibility, but has any company... Man, I won't have to eat my words. What is wrong? Is this okay to do? Um, I'm just going to give it a... Sorry, guys. You can tell I'm a, I'm a Nintendo 64 player by heart. <sighs> I look clean to you guys in there. I think it looks clean. Okay, let's try this again. I know this game does work, though. Okay, yeah, it does work. I just... I don't know, man. Sometimes my DS has problems reading games in general, though. Sometimes. I'm not sure why, but... Yeah. My... 3DS can in fact play DS games. So now we will. Man, I'm sorry. I'm. Man, I'm edging y'all. But I'm sure some of the audience out there is probably liking that. You sick, sick, sickos. Um. Yeah, see, I mean, I stuck it in, and the one from GameStop, in fact, does not work. Am I shocked? No, because I knew it would not. Okay, now let's put this in. I am don't, I don't know if it will work. If it, like, actually does not work, I'm gonna, like, actually be mad. Because, like, this game is actually, like somewhat half decent and I did enjoy playing it for like the one time that it worked on that. <laughs> Hallelujah. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well. Sorry y'all. I don't got one of them like fancy 3DSs where you can like actually screen record and stuff. Um guys, is this English? I don't think this is English. Um Netherlands? Huh? Well, apparently who I guess whoever had this before is from the Netherlands maybe. I don't know. I'm definitely a little confused there, but... Okay. Well, it seems like maybe this person... I don't remember, man. Um, I think whenever I actually played it on there, there was not as many of these characters showing up, because I'm pretty sure to get these characters... You need to, like, actually do something. I don't know. Okay. Touch Kiki to spin the wheel and pick out your decoration. See how lovely you can make the stage look with the patterns you've won. Okay, guys. Uh, which one's Kiki again? Man, I forgot. Oh. Is that Kiki? I'm sorry, y'all. I don't, I don't remember, man. Like, <laughs> wait, yo, I'm actually doing somewhat fly here. I didn't land on, um, okay, whoa, what? Okay, um, I'm supposed to, um, Huh? I'm so confused. I don't know what just happened, y'all. Sewing game. Well, okay, my melody. Use the sewing machine to piece together your dress. 
slide the stylus upwards to work the machine. Well, okay. Do I just do this? Oh, wait, hold up. Wait, do I? Eh? Oh, shit, Mom. Oh, that was quick. I mean, I, I so quick IRL, and apparently in this game too. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest, guys. Like being a hundred percent real here, this game is not worth no fifteen dollars. Cause man, I mean, okay. It's probably not rare, if I'm gonna be honest, but even if it was, this sucks. I mean, this is baby games. And I mean, like, you know, I like, you know, the baby games and stuff, or, you know, whatever, but, you know, for like, for over $10 for one, that's gonna have to be a no for me, so... I'm sorry, Geek Galaxy, but your prices on video games, man, I don't know how your, um, bigger in them, but, man, I'm sorry, they give you the silhouette of the stuff, though, so that makes it a bit easy, but... What was in the shopping cart? <laughs> did I win? Did I win? Please, did I win? I did it, OMG, guys. I did it. Eee. Oh my gosh. Man, where's cinnamon roll? Oh, there's cinnamon roll. I got buck cinnamon roll. Why can't you, like... This is so dumb. Why can't you, like, pet them? Like, you wouldn't do that. Oh, whoops. Um, okay. That's cinnamon roll. Ironing game. Is this like Housewife Simulator? I know, guys. Um, 2024 can't make that joke, but I mean, seriously, this is like, this is really like just mundane stuff. Why don't they got any stuff where you're like having to like use a hand drill? Like, I know that would probably be equally as dumb, but I mean, I think there needs to be a variety of stupid stuff to do in this game. See, I mean, like, man, look at this. Iron your dress, like, bro. That was ease. I'm sorry, cinnamon roll, but, like, give me a more of a challenge than that. Like, make me iron it with a bar of iron or something. Okay, that's that's bug cinnamon roll again. If you guys have been watching my identity V videos, you can probably figure out why I'm bugging poor cinnamon roll here. Okay, fry the ingredients. What do I do? Do I just kind of like scoot it around like wee? I mean, okay, this is fun, but honestly, guys, for a game where literally all you do is just, like, do, like, really... Man, I don't want to say stupid. Like, I don't want to actually say that as, like, a non-joke, but this really kind of is. Like, it's just repetitive motions over and over again. I don't know, I could... Man, I'm starting to think I might have even just been ripped off, possibly, because... Like, this was not worth what I paid for it. That's the most votes. Well, I'm having to actually, like, sit here and, like, 
member, bro. So who was the winner? I was not paying attention at first. I'm sorry. I don't know. I'm I'm thinking it's either Penguin Guy. Sorry, don't know his name. Or My Melody. I'm going to go with Penguin Guy because I think I've seen him show up more. Oh, apparently we had a dance contest. Okay, yeah, I was right. Yeah, see you guys, like... I don't know, I mean, okay, formal opinion on this game, man. After making you guys sit through a 15-minute video. Um... Like... Okay, it's a nice game. It is cute. And I love Hello Kitty, as you guys know, but... Uh, yeah, this was not worth $15. I keep saying 15, but I think it might have been 15.99 actually. Although hmm I don't know, y'all. I paid in cash, so obviously I don't get no like receipt for it, but uh, cuz I mean, who would, man? Not me. That's for sure. Control the confusing me. Um, hmm. Like, oh, your album is full. Um, no, I don't want to delete anything. Actually, let's look at the album if it is full, though. Yeah, I mean, I know they. I don't think in this game there is a way to erase data, so they probably just didn't. I don't know. I've never bought in games like Geek Galaxy before, so I don't know, but... I mean, look at this, though. Honestly, I don't know who owned this beforehand, man. <laughs> um... Aww. Man, I mean, as with everything, I always wonder, like, who owned this before, man? Like, I mean, I don't know. Clearly, whoever owned this before seemed to, first off, really enjoy that tiara. And second off, if their album is full, they must have played this a lot to, like, jeez. So, I mean, this must have been a good chunk of somebody's childhood, I'm assuming. But, uh, now it will be in my game collection, in which I will play it whenever I just want to play something Hello Kitty related. And probably just because... I can stim while playing it. We. I can't tell. Am I clicking through the same stuff? I think I am now, bro. Man, my memory issues, man. But. Okay. Final conclusion. Is the game good? Yes. Did I overpay for the game? Yes. But, eh, I mean, maybe it's better than ordering online. Actually, in this situation, I'm going to be honest, I don't know, man, because $15, that really was kind of steep, considering what you guys just seen me play. Would, would you buy... Would you pay that for that? Because under some normal circumstances, whenever I'm sane of mind, I would not, in fact. 
Yeah, what you see, you guys can see I do have experience with these shovelware games. As you can see, I got Lala Loopsy on here, which I have actually like not 100%ed it, but I have definitely completed it. Um, Imagine Figure Skater. Yeah, that's another one. Like, man. And then I got. I don't know, I think there is only two Phineas and Ferb DS games. So I have both of them, okay? And... Yeah, that's all I have for the video, guys. Um, sorry if you think I was not funny. Um, because now I feel bad for saying that it was a housewife simulator. I'm feeling like a certain YouTuber here who made a, can't say a similar joke, but who made a joke not necessarily appropriate for 2024 and um, then spent the rest of the video apologizing. But guys, I promise I won't do a parody of that yet. But I mean... Honestly, like, you know, really, though, like, um, this stuff with, like, sewing, ironing, like, where you literally only just do one thing, that's boring, like, I don't know, like, personally, I mean, I know there's not much they can really do, but, I mean, I don't know. I'm just saying, I'm I'm being really overly critical just because of how much I paid for this, because I'm not happy about it. I'm gonna be real here. Um, yeah, like, man, because I'd say this here, you know, the poor one that I got at GameStop, that was. I don't know, man, like, I think, you know, what I paid for it was at least fair. Because the thing is, is, you know, like, with these shovelware games, like, they're fun, but they don't really have anything actually to them. So, obviously, you know, if you go around trying to charge, like, you know, upwards of $20 for them... Like, people are not going to appreciate that. Because I know one thing. I'm not buying another, you know, one of these shovelware games from the store. Which, one of the reasons why I did buy it for $15 is because there was no prices listed out for the games that was in the case. So, I had to go over there and ask the guy to um get it out. And... Yeah, at that point, I wasn't, like, going to say, like, you know, well, I don't want it for that much, put it back. Like, of course not. Like, you know, once you get somebody to get it out, then it's kind of a given. Especially if they're getting it out of a glass case, then it is a given that you kind of have to get it. But, oh well, guys, um... If you like this video, give us a like, give us a subscriber, and comment down below if you also love Hello Kitty. Cause I do. I love Sanrio, but I love Hello Kitty. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!